right, we got these coolers, pre-chilled. Frozen water bottles. Oh yeah. Well, I have Nick on the phone from Patriot Coolers. How's it going, Nick? It's going all right, how are you doing? Doing pretty good. Hey, what's the story behind Patriot Coolers? Uh, Patriot Coolers' mission is to produce an affordable lifestyle brand with a patriotic message. Our primary goal is to give back to veterans. That's why we try to incorporate the 13 stripes and 50 stars on most of our product designs. That is a really cool design. How long has Patriot Coolers been in business? We were established in Houston, Texas in 2017. We observed the room in the market to provide products that support an outdoor lifestyle while also supporting the values that we believe in. I really think it's awesome to see Patriot Coolers support a great cause. Homes for Our Troops program. How effective has that program been? Homes for Our Troops effectiveness is why Patriot Coolers is excited to partner with them. They're holding 14 events this summer including volunteer days, community kickoffs, and key ceremonies all throughout the United States. Uh, we try to support veterans the best we can, and our partnership with Homes for Our Troops is definitely effective in helping us do so. That's really cool. What do you love about Homes for Our Troops program? I love that they're able to make such a dramatic difference in individual veterans' lives. Uh, there's a veteran who's getting a home donated in June in Houston, uh, it's mortgage-free. It has a screened-in porch, tented windows, and hardwood floors, all of which aids him in his recovery from his injuries. I'm sure Patriot Coolers has some big plans for his future. Are you able to share some of this? Moving forward, uh, we hope to continue to grow as a brand while continuing to give back to those who served us through a discount. Uh, we offer discounts to our active duty military veterans and first responders, and we really just want to help them out. Capacity difference, but pretty close. Bam! Let it begin. All right, let's take a look. See what's going on. That's what it looks like tonight. And unlatch and close. All right, we've left these coolers out all day. Let's see how hot they are since it's starting to cool down now. It's like 96 and some change. Let's see, it looks like 90. It's like 92 is the highest, fluctuates a little bit. Now, let's see what the underneath looks like temperature-wise. Low 50s. Watch out. Mid 50s. All right, watch out, baby. Let the ice melt commence. After yesterday's heat test, let's take a look, see how they're doing now. Oh, yeah. Definitely getting some melt now. Let's check it out. See what they got going tonight. Ice melt central right here. <laughs> oh. All right, it's that time again.
All right, let's see where this ice melt test is taking us. Ooh, still chilling. All right, guys, we've been ice testing the Patriot Cooler versus the Yeti. Let's check it out and see what's up. All right, here's the Yeti 65. Oh, those drinks look frosty cold. Good chunk of ice. Still uh, definitely cold. It's crazy. It's like, oh yeah. Thirst buster drinks right there. All right, let's see what the Patriot Cooler has for us. Ooh, looks like some still some icy cold drinks. Just a little bit less ice. Man, still pretty cold though. <laughs> Holy smokes. All right, that concludes our test. Which one do you think won? Also, uh, what cooler test do you want to see in the future?